Hi guys, I am installing and reviewing the extreme version for the Note 2. First we need to wipe and factory set the data. Yes. Yes. After that we need to wipe the catchy. Here it is. After that we need to click clean to install new ROM so that we can install a new ROM. Yes. Now I will select the custom ROM which I have stored in uh, memory card. Yeah, here it is. You need to click this. Yes, install extreme ROM. Here it has given the option to install manually. Yes, MIUI theme background and click next. After that we have to agree so that we can continue. Yes, I want to install. Yes, we not we need to install extreme ROM. Yes, full wipe, not a problem. I don't want all share, I want DVX, I don't want Dropbox. I don't want gear manager or hub or kids more or mega. Yes, I want my files. I don't know what it is. I want paper artist. Yes, I want full screen dialer. Yes. See. Yes. Yes, we need Polaris Viewer. I don't want mobile print. I don't want uh, stuff or something. I don't. I, uh, I don't want S note also. Uh, yes, I want test applications. Yes, I want white keyboard. I don't want Yahoo stuff. So I will click next. Yes, I want Chrome browser. I don't want Google. Uh, Google Drive. Google no. No. Gmail. Yes. Yes, I need Hangouts. Uh, yes, I want a maps instead. I don't want Google Mus Music because it takes so much of uh, charging. Yes, I want YouTube. Click next. Mm, I don't want anything from this, so I will click. I will click next. Now I have no idea about this, so I will click next. Yes, I will begin install now. See the installation has been started. See the now it's copying the system files. It takes a little bit of time, so don't worry. Just wait and see. After the installation completes, we need to restart the phone, and the boot will take up to two minutes because the applications will load for the first time. See all the system files are installing very quickly after, so after installing system first no, they will go to applications see the process See this uh, ROM, this modern version is double X UF ND3. Yeah, now installing applications. See, which I have selected. Now it will jump to 100%. After that, we need to click restart. Yes, installing one of completed, flashing over. Now I will click next because 100% about to complete. Come on. Installing something, jet plane, something. Jeep. 
explain explain yes heartbeat heart raising come on it's tired man yes it's done see now we need to click reboot yes click next and reboot yes now the system will um, phone will start the new boot screen the default boot sound as I said for the first time boot it takes a little bit of time so don't worry just wait and just wait for the phone to start after, after opening the files here the lights will blink so that you can select language and all All other lights will blink. Just wait and see. Yes, now phone has been started. I will select the English language. Yes. And I will click next. And I have Wi Fi connection, so I will enable Wi Fi so that my data will be off. Yes, connect. Yes, connected. Now I will click next. No, because I will use Titan backup, so it will be restored. My name is this. Done. Yes, finish. Now I will see the new wallpaper. First, I leave. I will off the data, so I will not be charged. See, there is no lagging. It will be very fast. I will open. I will open the applications. See how fast it has opened. See, I have messages opened. See how fast video opens very fast see and I will show you the version and all about device see here is the Android 4.4.2 version and this is the build number by clicking twice the developer mode will be turned on and this is the April 9th launched version and here so you can click USB debugging for the net that's it hope you like my video thank you